Hi there and welcome to today's class. For today's class, we're looking at the solution to Organic Chemistry Practical Experiment 2.3 solution. Now, in experiment 2.3, we're looking at the reaction of ethanol with ethanol chloride. Okay, so you have the procedures here. I'll just jump straight to answering the questions. Now, for the question section, question one says, How did the smell compare with that in experiment 2.2? Now, we've already treated experiment 2.2 in which we reacted ethanol with ethanoic acid. And we said it's called an esterification reaction in which our product there was ethyl ethanoate. Now, if you look at experiment 2.3, where we are reacting ethanol with ethanol chloride, this one here, our product is still the same thing which is ethyl ethanoate, all right? So both experiment 2.2 and 2.3 have the same product, which again is ethyl ethanoate. So now they're asking you, how did the smell compare with that in experiment 2.2? Now, since the product, since the major product in experiment 2.2 and experiment 2.3 are the same thing, so they will have the same smell, all right? So since the, the major product in experiment 2.2 and experiment 2.3 are the same thing they will have the same smell so the answer to this is that so you ask how the, the smells compare and the answer is that the smell is similar to that in experiment 2.2 all right why because the same product which is ethyl ethanoate and ester is formed so this is your answer so let's go and let's take question two Question 2 says, write a stepwise equation for the reaction and name the product responsible for the smell. Now, for what reaction? Well, the reaction of ethanol with ethanoic chloride. So if I react ethanol with ethanoic chloride, what are my products? So let's go get their products. So number 2, solution, I have ethanol. Ethanol is simply C2. H5OH, this is ethanol, combines with ethanoic chloride is CH3O or COCl. You have this, all right? So if I combine these two, what do I get? Um, my product becomes this. Combining these two, I'd have my first thing I have this ethyl ethanoate which is CH3C, that's um, CH3, C, double O, C2, H5. All right. So this is formula for ethyl ethanoate. Then the last one I have there is plus HCl, which is a hydrogen chloride gas. So plus HCl. Mind you, this is not hydrochloric acid, it's hydrogen chloride gas. So let's, let's, name, let's um, name each of the products and reactants. What I have here is hydrogen chloride gas. That's, the, that's what I have here. For this one, what I have here is ethyl ethanoate. I have ethyl ethanoate. That's this product. Okay, moving here. Now, what I had here was ethanol chloride, so ethanol chloride, okay? Also, what I had here is ethanol, so I had ethanol. All right, so this is the reaction of the, the equation of the reaction, so I have this. All right, let's look at the next question. Question 3 says, why was H2SO4 not necessary for this reaction to occur? Now, if you look at experiment 2.2, right, uh, we had that H2SO4, which is tetraoxysulfate 6 acid, right, was necessary. Now, the function of tetraoxysulfate 6 acid in experiment 2.2 was to act as a catalyst, all right, which is to speed up the rate of the reaction. Now, in this particular equation in, in this particular reaction we are asked why is that the same catalyst was not necessary for this reaction to occur then the answer the answer is that this reaction actually occurred very fast 
So the function of a catalyst, which in this case is H2SO4, is to speed up the rate of the, of the reaction. Now, in a case where the reaction occurs fast, we don't actually need a catalyst. So the reason is because the reaction occurs at a fast rate. Okay. So the reaction, option three, the reaction occurred at a fast um is here the fast rate so since the, the reaction occurred at the fast rate we don't actually need an a catalyst which in this case is the trousers of a six acid final question number four what gas was given off in the reaction so if you look at this one here the gas that was given off here was hydrogen chloride gas so that's the answer so what gas was given off in the reaction the answer is so the answer here is hydrogen chloride gas which is hcl okay so h um hcl hcl so i have this all right so this is um how we answer experiment 2.3 all right don't forget to hit the like button all right leave a comment tell us other experiments you'd want us to work on all time please make sure you subscribe so that you get notified and of course hit the bell icon so you get not notified whenever we upload a new content then finally don't forget to share this content to your friends so that they can also learn thank you and see you in our next class